Hello friends, welcome again to another session on speed mathematics. Today we are going to learn another very effective tool to multiply two numbers, but these numbers are of special type. So yes, it doesn't, uh, you know, uh, is like is very useful in terms of any two given numbers. But if there is a special pair of number, which I'll illustrate what these are, then this technique can be very, very handy. So let's say I have a two digit number, say 43. Okay. So the number is 43 and it is getting multiplied by another two digit number 47. Okay. 43 and 47. Now, um, what is the speciality about these numbers? So if you see the numbers, the tens place numbers, if you see, are same. So the tens place number, this is tens place isn't it tens place number place numbers are same numbers are same and if that is so uh, and the second condition is unit units place units place number if you see uh, units place numbers units place numbers add up to 10 add up to 10 right so if you get such kind of numbers then multiplication becomes easier for example another set is 51 and 59 another example could be 63 and 67 another could be 81 and 89 another could be 72 and 78 all of these numbers if they have if you get uh, such numbers and you want to multiply them it's very easy to multiply them how so what you need to do is you just multiply the uh, units place number that means in this case 7 and 3 and write 21 like that no problem and in this case you take 4 and multiply this with the next number to 4 right what is next number to 4 5 so 4 into 5 that is 20 so this will be the solution or this will be the calculation right easy enough right so you don't need to do the long process of multiplication and all the same way here now here, if you see 9 into 1 is 9, but then we, we are supposed to write two digit numbers, right? So if you multiply 9 into 1, 9 into 1, how much? You will get 9. But while writing, if you get only single digit, then write 0 and then 9. Okay, because we have to have two slots there, 0 and 9. And rest is nothing but 5 and multiply this by 5 plus 1, that is 6. So 5 into 6, you have to do 5 into 6 is equal to 30. And this 30 will sit over here so the answer is 3009 or the product is 3009 okay let's do this one again so 3 into 7 so first step is 3 into 7 is equal to 21 and the next is 6 into 6 plus 1 right 6 7 is a 42 right so hence the product will be 4 2 2 1 easy now in this case again let's say uh here 81 and 89 so again 9 times 1 is 0 9 so 9 into 1 we will write 0 9 and not only 9 okay and 8 into 9 so 8 into 8 plus 1 that is 72 so the product will be 7209 right very easy so you can do multiple number of times and you can see uh, take multiple examples and test for yourself so in this case now i will not be i will not be writing anything i'll just simply write the product so 2 8 the 16 and 7 8 the 56 isn't it so 5 6 1 6 see you can multiply so quickly another example 32 into 38 so 8 2 the 16 8 2 the 16 and 3 into 4 12 so 12 16 is the product okay another example 71 into 79 let's say okay now here 1 into 9 is 0 9 and 7 into 8, 7 plus 1, right? 7 into 7 plus 1, 7 into 56. So hence 5, 6, 0, 9. So how quickly you can simply multiply such numbers. Now it is true not only for two digit number. You can also do for three digit numbers. Three digit numbers. But again, the criteria will be same. The units place must add up to 10. And the other set of other digits, whatever is left over, have to be same. For example, if I have 112 into 118, so you know what to do. So these 2 plus 8 units place digit add up to 10, right? 
So 2 8 is 16. Simply write 2 8 is 16. Now what is left? 11. And here also 11. So 11 into 12 is 132. Isn't it? So hence, write 1, 3, 2, 1, 6. Okay. You can check the product is 1, 3, 2, 1, 6. Okay. Now let's take another example to, you know, 13, 133 into 137. Okay. 133 into 137. So you now know what to do. So 7 into 3 is 21, clearly. And now you have to do 13 into 13 plus 1. That is 13 into 14. That will come out to be 182. And like that, you can go on doing like this.